The movie that made me cry. Um, I don't know. I mean, I don't. Hmm. The first movie I remember that made me cry is uh, Edward Scissorhands. The Color Purple. Brian's song. Casablanca. Or more likely, it was Field of Dreams. The first film that made me cry was probably Champ with Ricky Schroeder. I think that was the first one, because I was a young kid, and how distraught he was, and the fact that I was crying, and I believed him in that moment. City Lights with Charles Chaplin. When the blind girl sees him at the end, I'm gonna get all choked up now when I think about it. I think Schindler's List. For someone who grew up in small town Virginia, to fully understand what so many people suffered through, it was heartbreaking. The first film that I remember that made me cry, it was Charlie Brown. <laughs> I was in love with Lan Pelt, and in one episode, they, they took his blanket away, and that brought me a lot of pain to see him suffer, and I just cry every single time I watched it. After I gave you my blanket, my life has been a nightmare. The first film where I was bawling my head off, Terms of Endearment with Shirley MacLaine, is at the nurse's station screaming. Give my daughter the shot! I, I was sobbing so uncontrollably. Night of the Hunter. It's kind of, you know, should have scared the pants out of me. Did that as well, but it made me cry. It was beautiful. Yeah. Life is Beautiful, the Italian film. That really got me. Shane. Brandon DeWile. I just remember going, Shane, come back, Shane. I was like, ah <laughs> The first movie that made me cry was um, Love Story. Love means never having to say you're sorry. Love means never having to say you're sorry. <laughs> I think that was it. Maybe Love Story, weirdly, when I was a little kid. I remember sneaking in and seeing it and crying while watching it and then leaving and being the punk that I was, telling everybody waiting in line that she dies in the end. The first film that, that made me cry was The Wizard of Oz. And I cried out of fear because of the flying monkeys. The yearling, when he makes a kid go out with a gun. I'm not good when critters are beaten up or cruel to or anything like that. Bambi, that's a tough one. That's a really tough one. Oh, for sure, the first film I ever saw was Bambi, and I'm, I'm sure I cried when uh, Bambi's mother dies. I think that really affected me. The first movie that made me cry, I think, was Old Yeller. Because when they put Old Yeller down, that was not, that was, that was too much for me. That was too much, I was devastated. Biscuit Eater, about a dog. I saw that first when I was probably eight years old or something like that. Cried my heart out. The first movie that made me cry was definitely E.T. The scene where E.T. dies. And then, of course, again, when he comes back to life. I mostly remember about watching E.T., my little sister standing up and saying, run E.T., run, in the theater, and crying because I was worried for her, because I thought, oh, I don't want her to be sad. Like the moment where he um, leaves the ground and is flying in his bike, and he's, ha, 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 you know, and he has that moment, that always gets me. It was E.T. when um, E.T. was finally leaving, and I knew that I would never see him again because I felt like I was Elliot. You know, I cried for Elliot in that movie. I'll be 